Good evening. Happy Friday, folks. Cheers. Picked up this uh, beer, and the uh, first thing I thought of is these three right here. Just quickly want to show you the differences in all three and which one I think is the best. I haven't done this in a while, and I've had some questions on it, so might as well crack a beer and go over these. My favorite is definitely the Koken. This uh, ball detent right here, as we can see, is nice and smooth and works well in the hand when you're getting into the tight areas, but by far the looseness of the 3 8 head on this is the winner. There will be a new design coming this year and uh, can't wait to see it. It'll be a 74 tooth or 72 tooth, I believe. And this is the old 36 tooth, so can't wait on that. And uh, here is the Nepros. It is held in by nylon, so it's kind of stiff at first. I believe it will loosen up over time. Uh, i given up on using it because it's just, it's stiff. This right here locks the pin in. So the spring-loaded uh, nylon piece right there is the loser on this one. The looseness on the 90 tooth right here, as we can see, is 90 gear. It is very nice, but uh, yeah, the only turnoff is that it does have a nylon piece here, which is kind of stiff in areas. I tend to grab the Koken a lot more, so the Koken by far is my go-to. So if you're thinking about all three, this is the Tone, I'd grab the Koken first. The Tone is definitely a ribbed design right here. It has no lock feature and it, yeah, it gets stuck and it really trippy so when you start using it and then it moves on you you think you broke something on the uh, on the screw or whatever you're taking off and the it's just this right here so it just feels funny it is a nice uh compact unit to have and um shows made in japan right here so it says japan right here there is your part number right there uh and it's a little tighter so yeah this is not definitely not too bad it loosened up. This was actually tight at first when I first got it. This actually did loosen up. Wow. So, yeah, it's not too bad as a compact unit, but, yeah, I find myself going back to the Koken every time. Super loose. You can literally just move your finger and just, that's how you could tell. You have low back drag, and you just barely move. With the Z-Series, you barely move, and, yeah, that's it. So, 36 tooth does not matter because... You just barely move it and it grabs to the next tooth so that's what's really nice about these this 90 tooth it is very 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 loose on that and does grab to the next teeth so that's not bad at all it is locking none of the other ones are locking this will actually this one is locking but uh there is you can see the difference on that right there the locking button does stick out a lot on that that's another drawback of the nepros there's more flush on the tony than the nepros this is super flush right here you can see right off the bat that that is super duper flush so yeah another win for the Koken. i keep going back to the Koken. so i get the question asked a lot which one should i go to Koken's definitely the winner. Keep an eye on them this year. Nepros is not that bad though. It's nice, shiny polish. I believe these handles are hollow on the inside and uh, they got a nice balance on them. Of course, this one's gonna be a little bit he more heavier because the, the uh, end on this, because it's a flex. But um, the switch kind of sticks out as well. As you can see, the switch on the Koken is a lot more flush. So a lot of thought was in the Koken. So you can see, very, very nice. All three are very nice tools. And then the switch on here sticks out as well. Very, very uh, positive though. It's not gonna switch on you in the middle of using it, which this is gonna be the most compact one right here. If you're in the back of an engine bay or something, it's not gonna switch on you. But just, yeah, this is always, uh, always gonna trip me out. Yeah. <laughs> so. This one does have the ball detent, but it's just one. And 
the middle right there and then when you get to the end on the flat side that's it but it's it's smooth so and definitely nice cushion grip on this evenly weighted and um i still need to decide more on the nipros because i i need to get more nipros to decide on that um so definitely don't want to put nipros down so i'm not too far in the nipros line but uh yeah coken for the win and uh yeah thank you for watching guys and uh happy friday cheers Thank <laughs> you.